Question number nine, Stuart Nash. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, to the Minister of Police, what criteria did the police use to decide whether or not to respond to a call from the public about a crime that is committed or is being committed? The Honourable Speaker. Chris Finlayson. Yes, on behalf of the Minister for Police, I am advised that all calls to police are coded by priority in general terms. There are four categories, those requiring an immediate response, a timely response, a managed response or no attendance required. I would go into the detail of them, but then I'd have Mr Robertson screaming at me that I was giving a speech. <laughs> uh, supplementary. <laughs> it's to be nasty. Supplementary <laughs> question, Stuart Nash. Why should the people of Russell have to put up with exactly none of the 32 burglaries in their town being solved in 2015? <laughs> The order, the Honourable Chris Finlayson. On behalf of the Minister of Police, uh, the issue would be whether the calls were lodged and whether uh, they were matters requiring an attendance. I don't know the particular de I don't know the particular details, Mr. Uh, Robertson of what goes on in Russell at a particular time. If he wanted a particular, if he wanted a particular question on Russell, he could have put that down. Uh, supplementary. Supplementary question, Stuart Nash. Does she think the people of the Clive community, just north of Napier, have grounds to feel pretty annoyed that the year after their community police station was closed, only three of the 76 burglaries reported were solved? Three of 76. The Honourable Christopher Nason. Well, on behalf of the Minister, it's, it's getting a long way away from the primary question, which dealt with response times to uh, and priorities uh, to calls. Uh, the, the, I, uh, again, I don't know the particular circumstances of what goes on in Clive at any one time, and I suggest if he wanted precise answers on Clive or Tam uh, any other part of the Hawke's Bay, he could put that down as a written question. Supplementary. Supplementary question, Stuart Nash. Does she believe her party has lived up to John Key's 2008 commitment to, quote, crack down on the serious end of crime, end quote, given that over 90 per cent of burglaries in the country went unsolved last year? The Honourable Chris Finlayson. On behalf of the Minister, that's much easier, yes. <laughs> Supplementary question, Stuart Nash. Is the reason why police simply haven't the resources on the ground to respond to and solve crime like burglaries because her government has underfunded police by $300 million, as acknowledged by the police commissioner himself? Oh, the, the Honourable Chris Fox. On behalf of the Minister, no, that's completely wrong. Since 2009, the government has boosted the annual police budget by $200 million to increase police number... What? By 600 to a record 8,907 sworn officers. Well, it's no surprise that I can answer this question. <laughs> question number nine.